Hi readers, welcome back. Today we're on Module F, Unit 2, Reading Lesson 9. Our target for today is readers describe character motivations and explain how their actions contribute to the sequence of events. So we're, we're thinking about what is motivating a character and how that contributes to the things that are happening in the story. All right, same materials as every single day, I feel like, for the last several days. You'll need your uh, copy of The Missing Manatee, your book club book, your reading journal or something to write on, and a pencil or something to write with. Listen and follow along as your teacher reads Chapter 18 of The Missing Manatee. So today we're going to be considering characters' actions and their behaviors and then asking why. Because when we ask why, that leads us to the character's motivation, the reason why they are doing something in a particular way. So, mystery readers ask why. So I'm going to be um, putting some events, some character actions in the left-hand side of this chart, and then I will ask why and reveal what I think is motivating the character to do this thing. So the first thing I have up is that Dirty Dan followed Skeet to the manatee spot. Ooh, pretty creepy, right? Why did he do that? Well, I'm thinking that the reason why is he wanted to confront Skeet to tell him the truth. So he followed Skeet to the manatee spot because he wants an opportunity to explain himself. That's what motivated him to follow Skeet. What else happened? Dirty Dan reveals to us that he let Blink shoot the gun. Why in the world would he ever let Blink do this, knowing that Blink has some special needs um, and it could be dangerous? Well, he tells us that he didn't think there would be any harm in letting Blink shoot at, a, at tennis balls in the water. He never ever imagined that there would be a manatee there. So that was what motivated him. He really didn't think it would be a big deal. Another event, Dirty Dan decided not to tell anyone about the manatee. He kept it a secret. And we find out in this chapter, the reason that he kept it a secret wasn't because he was being mean or vindictive. It was because he was really afraid that Blink would get in trouble, that the police would take Blink away from him, and that even Dirty Dan himself might have to go to jail. So he was afraid. He didn't want anybody to know. He just hoped that it would go away. So this is how we think about characters' actions. Ask why to determine their motivations behind why they are acting in a particular way. All right, let's move on to the next slide. You guessed it, now it's time for book clubs. Today you'll continue reading your mystery book club books, but when you meet with your book club groups today, I want you to discuss character actions and behaviors and then ask why. So jot down their actions and behaviors and then as a group ask why in order to determine what is motivating the character to do whatever it is that they're doing. So you're going to be doing this work as a group today. So you're hopefully, maybe your teacher will give you a piece of chart paper or you can work on a PowerPoint slide together if you're virtual or whiteboard um, or something else, but you're going, to, you're going to do this with your book clubs. You'll create a T-chart like the one that I created with character actions and behaviors on the left and then the question why on the right. So the actions and behaviors, you're gonna jot those from the story, ask why the character did these things or behaved this way, and then jot that under the why column. And that will give you what motivated the character to act or behave in that way. All right, it's time to go to book clubs, off you go.